Hi guys, this is Sai Kumar Kurtiwada. In this video, we will learn about how to test and form array with form controls in reactive forms in Angular. I have explained about form arrays with form controls with an example in my Angular tutorial video. I'll provide the link in the description. Please watch before continuing. Let me quickly jump into Visual Studio Code. Here, I have created a form array called as cities and I am looping this cities array here by using ngfer and I am using a get form control to type cast my form control and let me show you a small demo on this before continuing with the testing part here I have created this and if you inspect this let me go to the console and type something something zero something one so when I click on the get array values, I'll get the values of this by using form array dot value, which is an array format like zero index and one index. This is how we will be implementing our form arrays. So if you see here, we have looped this input fields and that input fields has been looped this many times. That means two form controls. So the loop has been iterated for two times and we are able to see two input fields with a button. When I click this button, I'm getting the values something zero and something one. So that's how a form array will work now what we'll do is we'll try to test this particular form controls let me go into the spec file and create a two variables like let fixture colon component fixture which is of type app component and let me create an instance let instance colon app component so this is my instance and also we are using the reactive forms module so i have imported in my imports module section and after compiling this components now i want to assign my fixture fixture is equal to test bed dot create component of app component so i am creating an app component and also let me create an instance based on this fixture fixture dot component instance so now I got the instance and I also got the fixture. Let me create a description for it. It of I want to test this form arrays. Test form arrays with form controls. So now what I want to do is I want to create an ID for this form controls. Now in this case I can create an ID or you have already a one single input which is looped a number of times so you can call by using input element selector for now I'll go with the ID ID is equal to let me create some ID which is a dynamic ID so now in this case I am creating control underscore with my index value index value indicates I so this time my ID will be control 0 for the first time control 1 for the second time so let me save this and go to the spec file now what i want to do is i want to update my fixture to bind form array with my html content detect changes fixture dot detect changes and then fixture when it is stable i'll get a promise so inside the promise callback function let me get the elements like const control 1 is colon HTML input element is equal to fixture dot debug element dot native element dot query selector of hash what is my form array the form array is equivalent to my control with one and also let me create control two colon HTML input element is equal to fixture dot debug element dot native element dot query selector of hash control underscore two so now i have two controls control one and control two let me update this controls with some values control one dot value equal to i want to give sample one and let me give the control two dot value equal to sample two i gave two input fields and now what I want to do is after this I want to detect some changes that means to detect the changes I want to dispatch some events so control one dot dispatch event to update that input fields with my form control name so I'm using that dispatch event and this time the event is 
input event so let me give input event and let me give control to dot dispatch event of new event of my input field now after dispatching these events let me update my fixture fixture dot detect changes I want to detect the changes and fixture dot when stable I'll get a promise based and that promise will have a callback function inside the callback function what I want to do is I want to get the values of that form array that means cities form array so I can get that by using const cities form array values is equal to instance dot cities dot value this will give an array so now I want to check that array values expect of cities form array value of 0 dot 2 equal of this one like sample 1 and then expect of cities form array value of 1 dot 2 equal of sample 2 so let me save this and also you can check in one more way like expect of cities form array dot to equal of I will get an array format so you can check the array format with sample 1 comma sample let me save this and it's compiling so we got some error let me check that can't set the property of null setting value so that means we are getting this control one as null so why it is getting null let me check that so go to this HTML file and here we are getting an I with null here we are getting some problem like can't set the property of null that means here control one and control two are there but in this case we have one and two but the index starts with zero so it has only two controls that is zero and one that is the reason we are getting this error let me save this again and if you see here it was successfully handled and the expectation has been reached successfully so you can see that total one success so that is how the form array can be tested in our angular application with form controls hope you like my explanation if you like my video like share subscribe to my channel for more updates signing off thank you